morning, good morning. As you guys are going to be able to tell, the roads are nice and dry for a change. And the sun is starting to come up, so I think it's going to be a good day. It is Sunday today. I hope you guys are having a good weekend. I'm about uh, 30 clicks away from uh, North Battleford, Saskatchewan. I got 424 kilometers to go to Edmonton, so we should be there quite early this afternoon. I think I left uh, left early uh, early this morning, so not super super early, but yeah, I left about quarter to seven. Yeah, it was pretty cold overnight. I think it went down to like 30 degrees Celsius overnight. But hopefully we're not going to have too many problems today with all the fuel and all that. I put some anti-jowling stuff in there yesterday, but we'll see if that does the job or not. And I guess we'll uh, see you guys down the road. Alrighty. We just stopped here in North Battle Fort. Go use the bathroom and then uh, I had me some cereal to eat. Got to have breakfast, right? So we got that behind us. Now we're going to put the hammer down to go into Edmonton. Yeah. We've got about four hours to drive, or just over four hours. About four and a quarter, I guess. If everything goes good, traffic is going to be good and everything. But yeah, it's nice sunny today. Nice sunny day. I love it. Got pretty cold today, but other than that, it's all right. Alrighty, I have made it down to Edmonton, Alberta. Finished dropping my trailer, and I uh, went over here to the Flying J. I don't think you can see a Flying J sign up here anywhere, but uh, it is a. Uh, I guess a shell slash flying J and they got a uh, Super 8 hotel right beside it and I'm gonna be parking here for the, for today I guess I'll probably be spending the night over here since I made myself available tomorrow morning so I guess we'll be working on videos today I got a couple of videos that I gotta catch up on so uh, we'll be working on that and then uh, Another thing that I wanted to say is uh, I wanted to thank tra Trucker Jukebox for the kind words that he had on his video today. I know this is going to be a week from today when you're watching this, but I'll certainly leave the link down below in the description for his, uh, his channel. And you can also watch the video that I'm talking about, the words that he said to me or about me. And that... Uh, that certainly is hard touching what he said to me uh, certainly means a lot to me and uh, I also gotten a few subscribers uh, just because of that I think and uh, I want to welcome you guys in thanks for uh, subscribing to my channel I appreciate every one of you guys because without you guys there wouldn't be this show right so uh, but uh, what I'm going to do is probably I'm going to go inside and give you guys a little bit of a tour of this Flying J. And I'll probably put background music in there so it's not as boring because I probably won't be talking in there. But we'll see what I'll do. Well, here it is. Got the washrooms right here. Got the uh, Super 8 Hotel. It's just down there. Got actually a bar down here. And uh, this is where the Super 8 has got their rooms. Got a Denny's up here. Got a driver's lounge up here. You know, at least they have a driver's lounge up here. There's not that many places up here in Canada that actually have a uh, driver's lounge. Got a big empty space up here. <coughs> yep. Yeah, she got a hair salon in there. Got some uh, things here to relax and play games, I guess. Yep. 
I guess you can spend your money over here. Almost smells like they're smoking in here, which I don't think that's legal. Oh, I guess you could take your picture in here. Oh man, look at that. Nah, I don't look that good anyways to take my picture of me. So what the heck. <laughs> hey, yep, let's go inside the flying shed itself. Yep, here we are. Got uh, a lot of equipment for, uh, I guess for the oil field uh, guys. A lot of these coveralls with them reflecting tape on it, I guess. Got all kinds of oil stuff over here. This is actually not bad. I like these kind of these kind of jackets are pretty good. They keep you pretty good warm, but these ones don't seem to be high quality though. Well, I bet you they're going to charge an arm and a leg. Wouldn't be surprised. 85 for that jacket. 85 for that. Yeah, that's not bad. Not bad. Got more stuff over here. I actually got a uh, Canada post office in here as well, which is unusual usually. Got all kinds of straps for flat deck guys. Yep. Got some lights in here. If you ever burn out the light or whatever, you can go get yourself a light. Well, I guess that's about going to do it for today. I just finished having me a shower. Now I feel a lot better. I feel more awake now. I was starting to get sleepy there for a little bit. But here we are. We are back alive. We are currently working on some of the videos. Already got two of them finished putting together and so I think we got two more to go or something like that so we should be in good shape. Yep. So I guess with that we shall see you tomorrow at 5 a.m. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to give me the thumbs up, share the video, hit that subscribe button and we are in good shape.